this is really impressive. Hey everybody and welcome to the show of the JavaScript runtime environments. Today we are comparing the Buzzy Bun, only two years old and has already reached 58 1900 stars on github against the 14 years old Node.js with an impressive 97,700 stars today we are going to compare performance and i'm going to start by showing you my setup on my right is the node server on my left is the band server and both applications are very similar uh, so we are retrieving questions from the database and then we are using egs uh, templating engine so we are going to read the template and then we are going to render with two variables now i made this on a public repository and you can find links on the description both application we run on two separate servers with identical specifications our test has 100 concurrent users that will sum up in a rama period of 12 seconds and the whole test will run for 15 seconds this is our test command now we are telling gmeter to test in a non-graphical mode and to use the test plan that I showed you earlier. And we are telling it here to save the dashboard in Gmeter test result. And we are ready, so let's go. End of run, our test ready. Let me now open our Google Chrome. And ladies and gentlemen, here our dashboard, my eyes go directly to the error rate and error rate, both frameworks have an error rate of zero. Beautiful, good. Bun have a 25 millisecond average response time. This is really impressive. Now let's go to the response time metric. This will have better visualization. Both applications start similar at seven millisecond. Seven millisecond, seven milliseconds, both application response time. This is really impressive. We are processing the request. We are fetching the database. We are reading a file from the file system. We are rendering the template. And we are sending back the response. As, as more we add concurrent user, Bun is showing us efficiency here. Bun is the orange and Node.js is the blue. And I'm trying to figure out now the biggest distance between the two frameworks. And it is here 37 and 64, almost twice as fast. As we come close to 100 concurrent users, you see here both applications are rising exponentially. We are in one gigabyte RAM server with one virtual CPU and this is completely normal. It, not normal, this is very good. Now let's go to the CPU usage metric and this requires me to open the Gmeter graphical mode. Both servers here are very similar with the slightly better performance for the BAN. Now BAN is the blue and Node.js is the red. And Bun is playing between like 70 and 83% CPU usage, where Node.js playing between like 70 and reach maximum of 93% CPU usage. Now the memory metric collector, Bun is the blue and Node.js is the red. And Node.js is handling the memory better. Node.js is using 69% of the memory, where Bun is using 72% of the memory. Ladies and gentlemen, today the Buzzy Bun demonstrated its performance improvement, and honestly, both runtime environments showed an exceptional speed. However, it is important to remember that there are so many other criteria to consider other than speed. I hope you enjoy watching and see you next time.